reflection. Room 14 was been learning about reflection for 2015. First thing was we had to had numbers. The numbers were one, two, three, four, five, six. Then when you go to your table, you have to fold your arms and sit quietly on the on the on the group's table. Then we had to write some questions on a big paper that had some questions too. So we wrote same, some of the same questions on the paper. Then Mr. Blakey told us to swap table when he said mushroom. Then we moved tables, all the paper had different questions, so we had to write on all of them when we, we finished. We had to come down to the mat and give our papers to Mr. Blakey. Then we got in a circle so Mr. Blakey can read our huge paper in the middle and he said this is very good ideas on the paper and we were so glad that we had heaps of different ideas that would be so good. Um, the questions were on the paper. Our first one was, what was good? What was um? Uh, ne next time you should do it. Um, we wrote that um that we should do. Christmas on um, next time when it's December and we should do um, and we should celebrate for New Year's um, I would like to celebrate uh, New Year's when it, when it's New Year's with next time. Next time when it's Christmas, I'm gonna be excited for for Christmas. I'm gonna be happy for when I get some presents for Christmas. And then when I get presents, I'm gonna be happy. And then they then. When it's in the class, I like reading with my teacher. Like, I like reading with my teacher and all my friends in those reading weeks. I really like it. Um, we do our activities in, on our iPad. Then when we finish, we export it to our group G Drive. Then we finish, then we can do something that Mr. Blakey tells us to do. When it's, when it's, when it's maker space, you, Mr. Blakey puts Mr. Tomato Wallace and Miss Langitipu on some grapes. Then Kiwis and Kiwis and Kia go to Miss Langitipu and, and <laughs> Kareru and Kareru go to Miss Mato Wallace. Then after that, when we went to Miss Langitipu's room, Miss Langitipu swapped some of us. And um, in this class, I really like doing math and what my teacher tells me to do. And I really love it in class. So 
when I look in the mirror, it's like reflection, like reflections in the mirror. Like when you look in the camera, it's like reflection, like me, I'm in the camera. And, um, and I, I am looking at the camera with my reflection on my face. My face is my reflection. Yeah, my, so my face is, you see my face is my reflection. So some people are recording about their reflection of the face and I am recording that about my reflection. So we're writing about reflection on our books and, then, and it's important that when you go in the mirror and you do makeup, we need to um, do makeup and then see reflection in the mirror. It's like your face in the mirror. Right now people are recording. Their reflection is on, is on the camera, so it's important that reflection is important. That you look in the mirror and do your makeup. It is important. Reflection is important. Okay. And we wrote about reflection in our books. When you look in, like, some people's mirrors, you have reflections. And when you look in the TV, you have reflections. Everywhere you have reflections. And it is so cool you have reflections. I really like when you have reflections. And it's a very cool look look at my reflection when I take off my glasses I look different to my reflection when my glasses on is on look I am different because look at my face look at the reflection you see that reflection then I pull on my glasses but look my reflection is very good so reflection is very important and very good so make sure that when you always need a mirror for your makeup it is very important okay very important so i'll see you next week